The State University of New York College at Geneseo was founded in 1871, consisting of about 4,500 students with a campus size of 220 acres. Within the middle of nowhere in New York, the sunset is what makes this campus special. Although from November to March, it will be snowing and most likely be covered in snow. You could either choose to live in a corridor room, which is a two-person room, or a suite type of room, which is a six to eight person room consisting four rooms with a liver room in the middle. I think the sweet type of room is better because you can easily get along with your sweet mates and share the living room together. <laughs> However, you would also need to share this toilet and shower as well. You would also have a free washer and dryer machine and also a study room where you can study without getting disturbed. The campus buildings are mostly made out of red bricks and is quite similar to the campus in Nikyo. There's a hill that I had to climb every day to get to my classes so that part is pretty hectic. This is my public speaking class where I learn the basics of how to speak publicly to a large audience and every class we have to give an impromptu speech, which is very challenging. This is my international marketing class where we learn how to develop, organize, and manage marketing strategies across multiple foreign nations. This is my video production class where we actually write scripts and shoot short films with a camera and also edit the footage. This is personally my favorite class since I cannot take this class in Japan. This is my advertising class where we explore various perspectives on advertising and its social functions both historically and contemporarily. As we have three dining halls in the campus, this is the second closest dining hall from my dorm. This is where I get my lunch. You get a sandwich, burrito, chicken rice, soup, and so on. This is the closest dining hall from my dorm, where you can get a pizza, rice plate with chicken and turkey, salad, fruits, ice cream, and so on. There is also a place where they sell sushi, which is pretty good. This is the college union where students hold events, have the college gift shop, and also there's Starbucks, and also has a place where you can play pool and also study. There's also a mail room where you can get your stuff from Amazon or from Japan. This is the college gym where you can use it for free and it's about five minutes away from my dorm. I am in the soccer club team here in Geneseo. We are currently playing a 6 vs 6 futsal league game. I also volunteered in making food for the community in Geneseo, which I made karage, and also participated on a Japanese culture event. I still try to volunteer in helping out the Geneseo community. There is also the college varsity teams where you can go watch their games for free if you are a student. I've also played basketball and table tennis. Playing American football in the night. To just cooking in the kitchen in the dorms. Or just hanging out in the common room with the friends that I made here in Geneseo.
for watching the World Cup. This was a special moment for me since we were watching the Netherlands versus Argentina with people from the Netherlands. It's been seven months already since I came here um, to Geneseo and I can't believe it. There's only two more months left until I go back to Japan. Um, so one advice I will give is make clear of what you want to um, do in the study abroad experience, plan it all out and take every opportunity when you can. And also one tip that I want to give is that you don't need to bring everything from Japan. Um, the stuff that you couldn't bring or don't have, you could also buy here. So that's one tip and one advice that I'll give.